Halsey has reportedly gone missing. He was last seen standing on the deck of an aircraft carrier. Breaking news. Admiral Burke has gone missing from his home. According to his wife, shortly after coming home from base at 3 p.m., he was nowhere. Laskova has gone missing. The first female pilot instructor of the Soviet Air Force, also known as... Every war, every country has their heroes. Greetings, admirals. This is Viktor Rankov speaking. I have received news of Apex, once again, having developed technology beyond anything the world has seen before. Technology that is extremely dangerous, although I must admit is quite intriguing. So here I am to personally deliver the details to you all. I am not one to repeat myself, so make sure to pay close attention. Admirals will now be able to obtain and utilize heroes of renown and military accomplishment. They can be acquired by collecting fragments. They're divided into three tiers, rare, epic, and legendary, and the number of skills possessed will vary by tier. What are hero skills? Each hero has different skills that are unlocked at certain levels. These skills can be activated during battles. Upgrading the skill level will boost their effects, making the hero more powerful. Once all respective skills have reached the max level, the ultimate, awakened skill is unlocked. Additionally, each hero has a talent buff. The talent buff will give a role-specific buff. When the phase gate is available, heroes can be managed and assigned. However, these heroes are divided into three roles, aircraft carrier, ship, and jet, and can only be deployed according to their area of specialty. Each role has two slots. One hero can be placed in each slot. Heroes must be placed within their designated role or specialty. Additionally, if you assign the administration heroes in a base slot, they can activate construction, research, and production buffs that are helpful for base growth. It's complicated, but stay with me. Let me showcase three legendary heroes. First, we have Burke. This hero has the ability to increase the number of deployable ships. Sounds good, right? Next is Raskova a jet roll hero. She will increase the chances of a successful jet anti-ship attack, also affecting carrier airstrike possibility. The last hero I'll be introducing today is Halsey, who prioritizes defensive capability over offense. When assigned, Halsey can increase the number of jets available for carrier defense. From now on, when entering a battle, the power of your heroes will be crucial for victory. The game has changed. Warfare needs heroes. Olivia has requested I share some additional details. To level up your heroes, you'll need to use Hero XP Chips items. And for every 10 levels upgraded, your hero star rating will increase by 1. However, keep in mind that unlike hero levels and star ratings, a hero's tier cannot be upgraded. Unfortunately, this means that an epic hero cannot be converted into a legendary hero. Also, make sure you hold onto any fragments left after hero acquisition. Trust me, these will go to good use. You will be able to use the remaining fragments to level up hero skills. That is all, as you are. It seems like there are other admirals who are looking for me. Hold on. Why is the phase gate spinning? Who the hell are you? How did you get in here? Bridge, bridge. Olivia! Security to the bridge! Arrest this man! Don't you dare take another step! <laughs> 